Teofan Sokharov, The Swarming of Honeybees, 1979. The Swarming of Honeybees by Teofan Sokharov might as well be an emblem of this exhibition. The combination of symbols and visual references in it conveys much of the atmosphere of the 70s and 80s in Bulgaria. We find ourselves in a plot in which a group of men watch indifferently as a swarm of bees leaves an old camera somewhere at sunset, somewhere on the pitch next to a football goal. You can see fragments of beekeeping equipment, of leaving women's feet in sandals, of a musical instrument which could all be something else, a picturesque fog. The photographically realistic images coexist with surreal elements and with painting abstractions completely left to the imagination at places. One of the gentlemen to the right of the composition, with a key in his hand, peeks from the canvas straight to the viewer as in search of empathy. The other one with a cigarette, though, as you can see, drowns in sadness as if on parting. Very often, Teofan Sokharov uses similar cuts of figures that look as though some of the characters have invaded the painting directly from reality. This tendency towards reportage nature and documentalism in painting, characteristic of the 70s and 80s, is associated with the other current line of the so-called associative metaphorism. In both, there is a revision of the basic concept of realism, typical of the Bulgarian art of that period, adding to it surreal, or as was customary to call them at the time, associative and metaphorical influences. The two directions are represented as, as complementing each other or in opposition. The citation of the photographic image is often interpreted as a device that is extremely in line with documentary truthfulness. However, it is never employed on its own, but it is almost always part of a composition with much more complex and even abstract meaning. In Teofan Sokharov's work, the plot is complicated and layered with elements to such an extent that only the artist can decode it. In the end, the meaning also changes over time. Today, the swarming of honeybees is already another story with many different nuances from those it had in 1979.